The roller coaster ride isn't finished yet, and it was all worth it. The ride continues into a destination only one wild team has been to before. It's official. The Iowa Wild are on their way for a second time ever to the Calder Cup playoffs. Well, it's been a, a season of up and downs, I think. Um, there's been a lot of, you know, we've had franchise, you know, point streaks, winning streaks, but there's also been, um, you know, some losing streaks in, in there as well. I think uh, this journey has been been pretty amazing. I think, um, like any season, there's there's ups and downs and, and ebbs and flows, but I think uh, uh, we've managed all those pretty well throughout the year, and, and uh, our goal is to make the playoffs, and we're super excited that it's here now. Uh, you know, been grinding away for quite a bit here, and you know, I think it's pretty funny it came down to the, the 72nd game, but um, I don't think we would have changed it you know, with the result we had, so you know, we're excited to be here. I mean, you work all summer uh, for the regular season, uh, get in shape and stuff like that, and you play 72 games during the regular season just to make it in a playoffs, and it's hard to make it in, and uh, when you're there, it's even harder to advance, so we're excited and uh, looking forward to it. Uh, to get to, to where we are today, it took uh, every single person buying in from day one, I think. Uh, when we, we stepped on Wells Fargo Arena the first time in training camp, um, we knew um, that, that our goal is to make the playoffs and, and make a deep run and, and uh, we knew that I was going to take every single guy no matter who was in our lineup every night. Obviously we played Rockford quite a bit of times uh, this season and, and we know that every single one of those games is, is hard fought. Um, um, they got a lot of skill up front, uh, they can score goals so uh, we got to manage that and, and uh, just play our game, stick to our identity and good things will happen. You know, tough battles, uh, close games, they play fast, they play hard, they got good goaltending. Uh, you know, just like us, and it's going to be evenly matched, but I think we're in a good position, um, you know, with where our game's at and what, with what we had to do to get in uh, to match up with them, so I'm excited. Oh, obviously, we know Rockford's a you know, really skilled team, and they got tons of good players and, and tons of skills, so we got to be able to, you know, contain that and, uh, you know, play our game. I think that, you know, we've played pretty well against them this year, and we got to continue to do that, you know, just play hard and uh, compete in all areas again. We expect a hard physical game. We've, we've obviously played them a lot this year and we know what to expect. Um, it's always a good rivalry when we, we play against Rockford. I mean, Rockford's a great team. We know how they play. We play them lots all season. Um, they're a well-coached team. They're really good and uh, you know it's going to be a hard fought series. They're going to come at us hard. Uh, we've had some good games against them all year, uh, but we've also played our best hockey against them. So uh, we're expecting a hard series. We're expecting some good games here, but we're ready.